What's up guys, the April Patreon rewards are now available. Armageddon, Teferi Time Reveler, and Nekusar the Mind Razor are all available through the end of the month. If you'd like to support our channel and pick up these sweet proxies, you can do so at patreon.com slash itresolves or clicking the link in the description below. What's going on guys, welcome to another gameplay video. We are going to jump in with part two uh, with this Orzov Aristocrats deck. Uh, unfortunately, if you didn't see the first video, we didn't really have the best of luck, uh, and I don't, I don't have high hopes for this list, I will say as well, but, uh, we do want to give it a fair shot. Uh, it may be that, you know, we're misplaying, it may be a million different things that could keep us from winning with this deck, so I just want to make sure that we're giving it the best shot we can, uh, just to be fair. So, let's, let's give another three games. Let's, let's try it out. Um. Hopefully you guys are enjoying these gameplay videos. I know we're sending a lot out at you. Uh, we certainly appreciate that you guys are taking the time to watch what we've got going on here. And uh, hopefully it is enjoyable. I'm actually going to take this too. Uh, let's see. Let's play out our swamp. And... Hmm. I'm going to play out the priest here. It's going to eat a removal spell, I'm sure. Um, but that's kind of okay. I'll attack here. I don't believe I'm going to block with this yet. Um, good, good. Woe Strider, huh? <clears throat> They're getting some good hits off of our deck. Uh, let's get this out. And... get this out let's target you sacrifice these two we're gonna get one of these guys back which is nice uh, deal a little bit of damage they're gonna have to sack a creature and then we'll also be able to play out uh, our lots top reaver yep play reaver out there get another two for one now this is, I mean, this is a strong play, so maybe this is what we needed, uh, and maybe this is what we weren't doing right, but uh, that's pretty good. Um, <laughs> we'll, we'll see. Uh, if they attack with both, I'm all too happy to, to block here, uh, just mitigate as much damage here as possible. Might be wrong, I might have had to have blocked with this instead, but... Uh, not 100% sure on that, to be honest. Um, all right. Hmm. Let's do this. We're going to exile this, so it's going to come back. Uh, then we're going to do this. They're going to have to sack. We're going to get to draw a card here uh, with essentially four mana open. Yep. And then we get our, uh, our Reaver back here. So that felt like, I mean, this feels like a good... A good game. I feel like we're fine. We're getting there with this deck. What it wants to do now, if that works or not, we'll see. But uh, I do feel like this is exactly what this deck is looking to do. Um, the The problem that we run into is if they have like a, a an Ember Cleave or something, um, or they have a way to deal with the Priest, which would just be a shock. We're in bad shape. Um, the Priest is really our engine here. If we lose that, I think we're just not we're not going to be able to do it. Um, Sure. Let's do this. Um, I think I'm actually going to keep this. Uh, we could scry here. I kind of don't want to to lose an extra creature, though, when we can sacrifice to the priest. Um, and we'll see. Maybe they, maybe they have a spell for it. Sure. Okay. Well, that's an interesting one. I haven't seen Tabalt very often lately. That's cool. It's a good card. Uh, 
Unfortunately, we do have a land full of, or a handful of lands. Wow. Uh, which is not great, but at least you know they're not going to kill us this turn. Yep. Ugh. Man. We are just not getting there, guys. Um. Alright, let's do this. Let's do this. Hmm. So it's going to be rough, because they're going to sacrifice this, uh, and it's going to deal good bit of damage here, but I think we kind of have to. Yep. Seriously? Another land? Like, <laughs> we are not having luck with this. How in the world are we getting this many lands in a row? Um, I mean, it's a creature. <laughs> Ugh. This feels so bad, guys. Um, we can draw a card here, but I really don't think we're we're in a position to. Uh, ooh, rough, rough. Um, we'll see. Maybe we can get there, but most likely not. They're gonna get that as well. That feels bad. Forgot they had robber. That was a mistake. Um. Well, maybe not so much a mistake. I just don't know if that was necessarily the right thing to do, but yeah. So what? This is going to deal four, five, six, seven. I mean, we got to we got to give ourselves the best shot. That does mean leaving the Woe Strider around. That's good. Also, P.S. I am uploading the previous video. Uh, by previous, I mean um, our our deck before this deck, which was very, very good. If you didn't check out the Eerie Ultimatum deck, holy crap, is that a sweet deck. Um, really? Can we kill ourselves? Can we do it? Suicide. If we're going to go out, there it is. <laughs> That was awful. And we drew another land. Holy crap. Okay, well, that was bad. Game one, real bad. Uh, let's go to game two. <laughs> Guys, this deck kind of just sucks. I'm very sorry to say that, but unfortunately, it's just not. It's not what I would like it to be. Um, if you're going to play Sacrifice, I think the Rakdos deck is very, very good. Uh, I think this one is very, very not as good. Um, and now we have no land. I mean, we have one, but we don't have <laughs> the inconsistencies here. It, it it's astronomical. Um, ugh, because jeez, this is terrible. I might be incorrect. I'm honestly not 100 percent sure. Um, I, I feel like I'm valuing this pretty heavily because of our our hand here. I think that's correct, though. I I don't know. Um. Like, yeah, I mean, it's a, it's a creature. <laughs> I don't know. That's very good. They get to equip it too, right? Oh, no, it's two. I'm sorry. Sticking the uh, activated ability. All right. Um, hmm. Let's play priest. I think we kind of have to lean on the priest. Next turn, we can Hunted Witness and Charming Prince, if we would like, then uh, use the Priest uh, to hopefully get rid of something on the opponent's side. Um, and it looks like they're just going to equip this, so that's fine. Yeah, you got it. Let's see. Let's do this. I think I'm going to Scry... We do need to hit a land here. I mean, both of those cards are very good for us. Don't get me wrong, but we... I, I, I hate to do this, but I do think we kind of have to... 
lean towards scrying here. Um, we'll get one of these guys back, obviously, which is kind of nice. Um, I hate that we're not draining here, but I do think it's very good for us to get rid of this Pelt Collector. Um, my assumption is next turn, they probably have like a questing beast. And like, that's going to suck. Um, but we will, I mean, we can Bastion into killing the questing beast uh, with with the priest if we need to. So there is a positive to it. Um, opponent really just sitting and waiting. Oh, we do get two land or two black mana. Unfortunately, we can't utilize it for anything. So, hey, helpful. <laughs> I guess we could have. No, nah, that wouldn't have really worked either. I was gonna say we could have done this in reverse and bastioned then charming prince, but we would have end up ended up with two black mana. So, well, that sucks. Um, nope, nope. This, do this. I will be surprised if we win this, but I will say we are in a more stable position, at least at the moment, than we have been in previous games. That is a hedge. That's 100% a hedge. Yeah. Yorvo, pretty awesome. It's very old school mono green. I'm into it. Yep. Hey, they didn't attack. Um... <laughs> Uh, let's see. Like, what do we even do here? Um, I think we just Bastion. We can get Cruel Celebrant down, but I think Bastion is a little bit more important because it's a higher mana cost. Honestly, nothing else. If we draw an untapped land, we can then next turn do Bastion into Cruel Celebrant. If we had done it reverse, we'd Cruel Celebrant first. We get into a position where we really can't do what we would like to do. Um, we're going to attack here. Uh, no, I don't love it, but because uh, we, we no longer can take a hit here. Is this going to kill? Yep. Feels bad, guys. Feels bad. They did not attack, though. That's a little weird. Um, no, we don't want you now. Um, we're going to Broodmoth again. At least now we can threaten the Vivian. I mean, it's something. And, like, we can just block. That's cool. That trample is going to be a problem. Uh, no attacks. <sighs> I don't like it. I don't like this deck. Really don't like it. Yep. Sure. Yep. Can't block. Taking it. Uh, look at there. Another land. Um, let's do this. Let's do this. Gotta take out Vivian here. Not really a choice either way. They could just only swing with this, and we're in bad shape. Now, they can also equip this, in which case we're in really bad shape. So, like, we're kind of just in bad shape. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Yep, yep. Do it. Because we can't block this for the record. Yep. And, like, even if we all outswung, it just doesn't matter. Uh, priest doesn't really help us. <laughs> Uh, 
Not much we can do here, guys. Unfortunately, I think we just lost. The fact that this has trample as well is pretty near impossible for us to beat. We literally have to do this or we die. Oh, we still die. Excuse me. I can't math correctly. We die. Either way. God, this deck is not what I want it to be. Um, all right. Last game. We're going to try it. Uh, while we're waiting for this match to start, um, well, that didn't take long. Uh, if you're interested in signing up for our Aquaria giveaway, uh, we do have that going on right now. That is uh, going on until May. What in the world? No. Um, yes. And I don't really want to put any of these back, but I'm going to do this. Um, that is going on until... May 16th, Saturday, May 16th, uh, which is when it's the day after the set drops in paper. Uh, you can enter to win a free bundle. All you got to do, comment on any video uh, with hashtag Aquaria giveaway. It literally can be any video. Uh, once you do that um, and you're subscribed, obviously, then you're entered to win. Pretty straightforward. Um, we'd really appreciate the support. That's all there is to it. Uh, let's do this. I kind of like both of these. Um, I feel like we should be digging for a priest, but I also, also I also think this deck kind of sucks. So <laughs> I shouldn't be recording a video with a deck that I think sucks. That's not very fair, um, to be honest. But Nice. They didn't mock. Um, let's do this. Oh my goodness. Don't think this one's going to be great. Um, the previous deck is, though. I have to write a description for this. Um, hmm. Pardon me whilst I write a description for a video that you will all see, hopefully. Uh, double black uh oops no let's just do uh yeah let's just do this <clears throat> we get two damage in either way it's kind of nice oh <sighs> Visibility. Publish. Okay. Hey, look. Our second black source. You. You. Me. Yeah, I don't know. Let's just do it. Why not? Gotta do something. Uh, guys, just a heads up. If you do have a deck suggestion for us, uh, we've had some people actually bring it up that, ugh, that feels terrible. Uh, that, you know, they've got decks, they want us to try that kind of thing. Feel free, suggest them. Uh, we would absolutely love to see what you guys have in store. Uh, and certainly it is much appreciated, so... <clears throat> if you do have anything, please make sure to share it. Uh, send us a link. Just uh, post the deck list. Do whatever you want to do. Uh, we're happy to give it a shot. 
Okay, but see here, honestly, they could just like steal the or copy. <laughs> they could just keep stealing our brood moths, and then we just have no flying. So they can just win that way. Um, they also have Thassa, though. I'm sure that's kind of difficult to. I would have definitely taken Thassa. You get extra Garuda. I mean, you got you got plenty of power on board. Don't get me wrong, but. Yep. Oh, okay. That makes sense. They had a Thassa in hand. Okay. Sure. Block you. Block you. And is that it? Yeah. Woo! Killing it. So it probably isn't going to matter. Um, that's cool. They just gained their life back. <laughs> Ugh. Woo, we got a 2-2. Let's go. We're winning now, guys. Ugh. <laughs> <sighs> Hey, if you want this It Resolves hoodie, let me know in the comment section. Just a heads up. That'd be cool. If anybody wants one. I, I don't know. We we made these just for fun. For us, in particular. Um, we didn't really make them f to send out to people. But, hey, if you want one. It's cool. Yep. Uh, you. 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 Wait a second. I mean, they're just gonna. Watch us die. I'm surprised they didn't mutate that. Could they have mutated it? Maybe they couldn't have. Oh, I guess it doesn't matter because Broodmoth. Got him to four. Woo! <laughs> Can we get... We might... Okay, but hear me out. There's a world where we win this. It's a very, very silly way that we could win. But we could. Gotta pick one. Can't have both. I just gonna forever bounce. No, that doesn't work. I was gonna say that'd be kind of funny. <laughs> <clears throat> oh, okay. No, just kidding. I lied. That's not happening. Woo! Um, guys, this deck isn't very good. We're we're conceding. All right, we're done with this deck. I don't like this one. I'll just be honest. <clears throat> if you're gonna play a sacrifice list, I don't see why you would not play the Rakdos sacrifice list. I also don't get why in the world there was not a Witch's Oven combo in this. I understand I could have changed it, but I was trying to go and see maybe there's a reason it's not there. I, I like all the cards in this deck. I just don't think they're very good. I, I mean, in this iteration. Uh, so unfortunately, I don't think this is worth really trying out. If, you, if you're if you interested in Orzov, we've, we've tested it. You don't have to. Uh, if you've got a better list, please share it. Uh, I am sure there's another Orzov list out there that's very good. I don't know if it needs to be an aristocrats style deck. Uh, I think that, you know, humans, just in general, is a very good archetype. We've got Mardu humans right now, which is something we've tested. So pretty decent success. I think it's a good deck. Um, maybe there's a Orzov version that's not bad either. But regardless, I don't think this deck is great. I, I would not recommend it. But we tested it for you, so you don't have to. So... Hopefully you guys enjoyed it, despite just us, I think 0-6 is our final record. But hey, it was fun. We got to test a thing. So I will check you guys later in the next gameplay video. But I hope you enjoyed it. I will see you uh, very, very soon. Thanks, guys. Bye.